This video is for blacks, Negroes, coloreds, and African Americans. This is the one way you will ever receive reparations. Stay tuned. morning. Today is February the 1st. Um, I'm doing a business conversation right now, which is why I'm wearing my business hat. Tomorrow morning, I fly out to Los Angeles for a gig I'm doing. I'll be in rock star mode till Sunday. Then I'll be back in regular daddy mode on Sunday night. But for right now, let's talk about some business. But not just any business. Let's talk about, okay, here's how I want to put it. Now, I know you're going to think I'm being whatever, but hear me out. In my lifetime, there have been five, four or five prominent figures that look like me. Those prominent figures had platforms that they stood on where they discussed what was important to them, what mattered most. Those gentlemen were, and I'm just using gentlemen because you'll see why in a second. Those gentlemen were Noble Drew Ali, peace be unto him, Marcus Garvey, peace be unto him, Malcolm X, peace be unto him, Martin Luther King Jr., peace be unto him. And if I was to throw one more in, it would be Dick Gregory, peace be unto him. Five brothers who have gone on, transitioned, stood for things. As of late, there's been this swelling of conversations about reparations for so-called African Americans. There's one gentleman who I have yet to meet, but I plan to meet him next month, who in my opinion embodies what all five of those uh, ancestors stood for. And he did that by using all of his many, many years of experience as CEO and, and uh, uh, CIO of major Fortune 500 companies. And put it all together in one company. And then when the tides started turning, pivoted and through the full weight of his company and all of his business contacts and influences into one particular vertical. Now there are hundreds if not thousands of brothers in this country alone that are successful businessmen who have made decisions that created multiple millions and billions of dollars in revenue for businesses 
that they built or that they are the CEO for or president, vice president. To them, I commend them. But this one gentleman, in one decision, created what I believe as the only way so-called African Americans will ever receive reparations. Reparations mean to repair. And what's the one thing that can repair not only African Americans, but poor disenfranchised European Americans too? It's money. And then when you couple that money with the financial literacy needed to hang on to that money without like Dave Chappelle's skit was where they had this reparation skit where they gave all the brothers and sisters a certain amount of money. And in the skit, we all ran out and bought crazy stuff and just gave it all back to the economy. I'm rich, bitch. Which is what we're going to do anyway, but if you do it the right way, you get to maintain your wealth. You actually start to create wealth because I don't care how much money you got right now. That means you're wealthy. That means you got money. Wealth is measured in time, but we'll get into that some other time. Let me just say this. This gentleman has created a business platform that's already on pace to be a multi-billion dollar company. Already been working for however many years. The pivot is going towards a multi-trillion dollar industry. Now for people who don't want anything to do with starting a business, with the, the risk factor, that's fine, keep listening. But what if, think to yourself, I'm not going to give you an example of a particular business, but think to yourself of a business that is huge right now. Amazon, Apple, Tesla, you name it, Samsung, Microsoft. Think of a huge, huge business. Think of the person who owns that business. Or think of the person that you recognize from that business. And then go back to when that business was just starting and nobody knew about it. And let's just say you happen to have been friends with that person. And if they had come to you and said, look, I got a way for you to if you follow me and if I'm successful, I've got a way to generate income in your pocket for the rest of your life, your children's lives and your children's children's lives. And all I need you to do is go here. If you go here, it's going to cost you 99 bucks a month. Or you can pay for the whole year by paying 997, which is only 10 months. And we'll give you two months for free. And what you get with that, let's say it's Amazon. What you get with that is a Amazon store built and loaded with products. I'll do the marketing for you. And I'll also give you a thousand television commercials every month to market your store. In whatever zip code you choose to market your store in. And for doing that, I'm going to give you a share of my company. Ten shares to be exact. I'm going to give you ten shares of my company stock. Which means you'll be a dividend recipient. So every month that my business makes money, I'm going to take 5% of the net profit after everything's paid. 
I'm going to take 5% of the net profit and I'm going to distribute it across 10,000 shareholders and no more. When we hit 10,000, there'll be no more shareholders. So let's say we do a million dollars. And when I say these numbers, these numbers are what we generated net after all bills are paid and we net a million bucks and that million bucks is the 5%, not the total company, but the 5% of net profit is a million dollars. Divide that by 10,000 and that's how much you're going to make the first month. So going forward, when I speak, guys, I'm t when I say a number, that number is the 5%. Net. The next month, the company grows. And we're talking about like Amazon. Next month, the company grows and the net 5%, I'm going to call it net 5. The net 5 is 5 million. The next month, the net 5 is 10. The next month, the net 5 is 20. The next month, the net 5 is 40. The next month, the net five is $120 million. So let's say that net five in six months is $200 million. Don't think that that's inconceivable. But let's just say that that net five is $200 million. That's what you put in your pocket that month. You think you can make it on that? Now, let's go further. We're talking a $7 trillion industry. And there's only one company that's doing it and have no competition. I'm not asking you to start a business unless you choose to. Me, I like making businesses. I like starting businesses, and I really like being part owner of a business. But let's just say you want to put something in place where you can successfully generate a dividend from a major corporation every month. People do it every day. They buy dividends sharing stocks. They, base, they buy stocks that pay up monthly dividends. I'm giving you one right now. <laughs> I'm giving you one. So what you want to do is go to the link, read, watch, watch, read, do some research, look into it. Do it quickly, though. Because we're already at 6,000 shareholders. Oh, by the way. And again, you don't have to start a business. You just buy the, share, you buy the, buy the business so they can give you the shares. Because you're not buying shares. They're giving them away. They're only giving them away to people who buy the system. And once they hit 10,000, it's over. Now, here's another example. Check this. This is where it gets crazy. What if when we hit the 10,000, and I anticipate hitting the 10,000 before the 15th of this month, I'll be shocked if we don't hit 10,000 by the 15th. But what if, let's say on May 1st, 2023, of the 10,000 shareholders, 1,000 for whatever reason, are no longer members. For whatever reason, maybe the shares weren't growing fast enough for them. Maybe they weren't making enough money for it to make sense to them. Whatever the reason, okay, short-sightedness. What if on May 1st, the 10,000 goes down to 7,000. 3,000 people dropped out. For whatever reason. Guess what? 
You think they're going to stack up another 3,000? No. We, the shareholders, the owners, the dividend recipients will continue to split the 5%, the net five, by 7,000. Go to the link. Some of you, I sent this to you personally. And you may say, well, if you don't have to market it, why are you marketing it? That's easy. I'm sending it to everybody I know because don't count on government to give you another shot like this. Don't count on it. This is it. To become a part of a multi-billion dollar company in a seven trillion dollar industry that will be at 46 to 50 trillion by 2035. And a company that has no competition. The biggest spokesperson we have is the president of the United States and the federal government. And guess what they don't have? Guess what? the president of the United States and the federal government and the mandate that has been made for this project, guess what they don't have? A sales force. Well, now they do. And you can benefit from the sales force of which I'm a part and don't have to do a thing. Click on the link. You're welcome. With that, it's always imparting. Peace.